What's up, YouTube Alpha? And Lambda. And we're here to bring you a juice review today that we just got in the shop. This juice, uh, Beta called up this company and he tried it when he was at a, a uh, cloud comp up in Albany at 51 Vapes. If you're up in Colonies, Connecticut, Clifton Park, they're all over the place up there. Check out 51 Vapes, great shop. Shout out. But um, anyway, he was up there and he tried uh, this grandfathered and grandfather not fathered grandfather and it was this unbelievable flavor so public brew is who makes it so we said you know what we'll give it a try so i started vaping on it and i didn't put it down and beta lost the bottle <laughs> and it fell in my pocket and i vaped the whole thing at least so, you found it right so we called up for samples and we got them in we ordered it right away they're a great company i forget where they're out of um, if you need to get a hold of them, you can contact them at publicbrew.com. It'll be in the description below. But um, it is a, what is it, VGPG? It doesn't say. I'm looking right now. I don't think it says it on it. It does not specify. Is the bottle set? <coughs> and they're out of California. Cali, it, it, baby. it does not say what it is, but it does say graham cracker milk equals happiness on the bottle. I think that's pretty cool. But it's a 60 ml bottle. This is in three nick. We're going to go ahead and give it a vape. The second flavor is so unique, and we didn't even try it before we ordered it for the store if we knew it would be good because the first one was off the rocker. But we'll off let you the know. Chain. I just got new plates for the Limitless. Even smells like a graham cracker. It's truly a graham cracker dipped in milk. And that's all it is. It, it's truly a 10. I can't even go into any more description. It's a graham cracker with milk. Not a lot of cinnamon. Perfectly done. Spot on. I'll give it a 10. Yeah, that's There's nothing wrong with it. <laughs> graham cracker and milk. Yeah, milk it's and graham amazing. cracker. And the description that they write on their flavor card is a yummy combination of graham crackers and milk that hits all the right notes. Not too sweet, not too savory, just smooth. Enjoy the signature aftertaste. Wow. Yeah. And it's really good. I can't show you grandmother yet. So that's grandfather. That's, that's definitely a ten for me too. That's. On point. Yeah, it's, it's on point. That's an amazing juice. Oof. It really is. It's so good. Like, once you pick it up, you can't stop vaping it. In a tank or a dripping, it's phenomenal. On a hot build like this, it is unbelievable. The, the graham cracker comes out and the milk comes out so much on a hot build. Try it. It's slamming. So, Yo. the second one, you didn't juice up. Three, uh, zero. So, we're going to have to take a minute. So, Lambda's going to talk to you for a moment. This was supposed to be done a few Lambda minutes ago. Here. <laughs> How are you guys? I'm doing dandy. Read the flavor profile. Dude. Read the flavor profile. Don't tell me how to live my life. To grandmother. Graham mother or Graham mother. All right, Sean. <laughs> Our classic graham cracker taste, topped with mother's pear, yeah, mother's pear medley and a signature smooth coconut finish. That sounds fucking delicious. It smells good. Mm. She's rowdy. Don't put your face in front of that. <laughs> it smells tasty. So this one I was kind of skeptical on as far as um, it's that piece of cotton. Yeah, graham cracker and pear. I wouldn't normally think would pear, but uh, <laughs> it smells really good. So I was kind of skeptical on it only because of the coconut milk and pear with graham cracker. All right, like so coconuts and cinnamon I could see, but pears and cinnamon? That was it. 
It's so broken up. It's like layered. Like you get a slight graham cracker up front. What are you barking at? You, you get a slight graham cracker up front and then this nice light pear and then oh, it's wow, coconut yeah. milk that finishes heavy. And that pear tastes almost like the nashi pear. Similar. That sweet, juicy pear. But they, they have this coconut milk finish that's so distinguished from like the regular grandfather that has this real great milk finish. But this is bar none, this coconut milk finish that's amazing. It really is. A, it's a spot on. Uh, I would give this one a 9 to a 9.5. Drip it. Um, and I'm back. Have a great day. I should be back. She just needed the house key. So this is definitely a great use. I would give it a 9. That's exactly what I was going to say. 9. For uniqueness, I would go 10. The coconut milk is spot on, but I'm not a big coconut milk guy. And the graham cracker isn't like right up front like the other one. It's more mixed in with the pear and coconut. For me, I get like that graham cracker pear and then finishes with coconut. Right, it's split, but I think if they added a little more graham crackerness to it, it would be a 10. Yeah, it might balance it out more. Because to me, it does taste more just like pear coconut. You don't get a real strong graham cracker. It's and still really good, though. Did you read the, uh, yes. the profile? Yep. All right. I wasn't listening. Yeah, see, it says the classic graham cracker taste. So I think that's just off a tiny bit. I get more graham cracker in the aftertaste than... I'll give you that. The, yeah. But it's it's not like the prevalency of the original. Yeah, like when you're vaping it, so, you're not tasting the graham cracker. Right. Graham cracker. So I think it needs to be up front like the original just grandfather. A teensy bit more. And if they did that, this would be a 10 also. But both of these juices, bar none, are phenomenal. The whole line together, both of them get a 9.5. But they're already available here at Good Apes. And you can find them on publicbrew.com. B R U. And they'll be down in the description below. Make sure you check out cassad.org, notblowingsmoke.org, august8th.org. Make sure you continue to fight for your rights to vape people. It's not over. August 8th has come and gone. And it's we still need to continue. Beginning. Because there is things that need to be passed. There's fights that need to continue. People need to continue to stand up for our rights to vape. Things are changing. Look at Pennsylvania. They got it turned over. So things are in the works. Things can happen. It's beautiful. So continue to fight for this industry. This industry has done a lot to save lives. So we need to continue to try and save it. Support your local vape shops, guys. And we are very proud of something that I need to show you. So, the new vaping magazine. It's the special edition. And Check it's out for page 106, guys. September and October. And on page 106. That's 106. You will see. Our ugly mugs. Ugly mugs. And Amir from Vaping Magazine, thank you so much, man. Oh, man. This is amazing. For our shop opening to make Vaping Magazine was like a dream come true. Thank you so much. And well-written article. Thank you so much. But remember, people, it's not over yet. This industry is not going to die, but it will if you won't get off your ass and write a letter, write an email, make phone calls, go to the rallies, go to CASA, sign up, get the emails, do whatever you need to do. Take a second, hit share, hit like. Hit the no. thumbs up button. I promise Take a fraction you. of a second. Just talking shit about the FDA is not going to change anything. We can hate the FDA as much as we want. They're not going to stop existing. Be strategic with your words. Don't get on the internet and say fuck big tobacco. Don't get on. I mean, if you want to hashtag something, go right ahead. But don't make some stupid video saying all that stuff. Because they do monitor stuff like this. And that's not what we need to do. We need to show them that we are people and we're business people and that we stand up for what we believe in and we know this saves lives. So 
just keep that in mind and just take it for what it's worth. Leave comments down below. We have a couple uh, extra bottles of juice that people sent us, and uh, I'd like to give them away. So Ooh, you want to give stuff away? Yeah. For free? For free. You guys like free stuff, right? So I thought so. In the header of this video, <laughs> it'll say giveaway, and then it'll give the name of the juice line. Oh, a juice line. So the first person. That's a whole line. The Pretty first easy. person that. Well, it, it might be these, along with some other lines, but... Who knows? We have a nice goodie bag that we will send out. A good bag. But there might be a couple winners. What you need to do is go to the descriptions down below for the Rip Trippers video or the Mike Vapes video, Brand and you'll see video. where to donate. The screenshot it that you donated. I don't care if it's a dollar, five dollars, what it is. And we'll randomly pick three... Not one, not two, but three. Fuck you, that's the way I do it. <laughs> so three names out of it with a randomizer, and that's who will win a few lines of juice. And it's only if you donate and you screenshot it. If you guys don't want it, I don't see any screenshots, it's fine. But that's all I want is somebody to give, and it's not going in my pockets or his pockets or anybody else's. It's going in to continue to fight for our rights to vape. So like I said, I don't care if it's dollar, five dollars, ten dollars, hundred dollars, thousand dollars, whatever it is, you're all gonna be equal. Now, uh, what and platform, it's gonna be randomized. What platform do they have to share that picture on? You want Instagram? Right on this. Oh, right on this, okay. Yeah. You can, I, I didn't know you could do that. In the comment section? Yeah. Can you add a picture? No? I don't think so. Well if you can't well, if add a picture, can't. post on Instagram and tag us in the picture. Or Facebook. Or, but, Facebook. or both. Yeah. Actually, you know what? You have to do them both. You have to do it on our Facebook page and then the Instagram page. There you go. That works. So that's the way it's going to work. So if you want some free shit, go ahead and do that. And somebody might just, like, get a random setup along with Who something. Knows? You never know. Somebody just got a setup in the mail today. I have the receipt here. They just got a... Oh, tracking number. So we Hashtag got that track out. track that shit. And I forget who that was already, and we left him hanging for like three weeks because I had my aunt die and a whole bunch of other stuff. Sorry about that, brother. It's Things happen in life, and he was very understanding, so we appreciate it. Definitely, man. But remember, if you didn't listen to this whole video, you won't even know about the giveaway. So we will see Let's you next time. Thought. Make sure you hit all of our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all that happy horse shit. Like all that stuff. Make sure you make Come comments, through. man. We appreciate the comments. And yes, my hat's a little cock sideways, so if you want to make that joke again, go ahead. And we will uh, see you next time. This is Alpha. This is Lambda. And we're out. We out, though.